Welcome, one and all, whoever may be watching this, this will be part 15 of Banishers Ghosts of New Eden. Uh, just want to say apologies for the change in upload schedule. I know there'll be a day where there'll be a video missing and it's just... I haven't been particularly well and um, I've also just been dealing with some other things so I just wasn't able to get the video edited and up in time. So I do apologize for that. Um, hopefully you can sort of keep things a bit more consistent moving forward. We'll just have to see how it all sort of works. Anyway, so let's jump into this. All right, so we've made progress. We fought the little beastie. Um, I don't know, helped Kate and Thick Skin reconcile or something. Um, saved the, the settlement. And I guess now we're heading down to this settlement and we'll see what ails them, I guess, as we make our way over to the final settlement being New Eden. Can't wait to see what big bad guys are introduced in this area. I like that the objective is reach New Eden Town, so my... The scourge troubles me. It's gone. The curse is lifted. The curse remains. The beast was born of it. A scourge made in equal measure from the treachery of the Newsmith sisters. Worse, though shaped by Thick Skin's betrayal, it was driven by Kate's. I feel like the greatest part of the story is still missing. The Newsmiths alone did not create the nightmare. Others in New Eden have treacheries to hide. I wonder what they did to earn such hate. So it sounds like the curse is of their own making. Sort of a summary of that conversation, I guess. That Kate, uh, I think it was Kate betrayed her love and then Thick Skin betrayed the settlers. And the Scourge has kind of fed off of all of that. So this is a curse of the people's making. I think is what they're getting at. Uh, let's see what's this way. I hear noises. <laughs> oh, so I came this way and the only thing I picked up was some, what, hoof fungus and wild shovel or whatever. Yep, cool. Hey, oh look, there's another thing. How do we get that? If wisps did they come back to bite, I'd almost feel sorry for these ones being caged. What are spirit snares do now here? I believe we should come to terms with the fact that New Eden brims with demonologist craft. So now I can go back to all the places we've run into those. Whoa, she scares me every time she appears. Is it just me, or does it sound like Salazar Slytherin is out and about speaking some parcel tongue? Maybe it's supposed to be the waterfall. Promise is unkept, covenants broken, the curse has its roots in betrayal treachery that led perhaps to grief do 
to forsake your love hurts everyone. Kate is proof of that. It's rarely so simple. Thick skin is proof of that. True story. So it just said we're entering some kind of marshland and I feel like marshes are very interesting places. I'm just trying to think what enemies they could sort of bring in at this point because obviously they're going to have to do that. Ooh, inky cap coprin. Hey. Okay, so this is just another way we could have gone. Oh, what can you do about this? Can we like run and jump into it? Nope. No heavy attack. Okay, I just want to check. It's been a long time since she's actually done anything new. So I just wanted to make sure I wasn't missing something, which, I mean, I still possibly could be. Yes? Why are we um, focusing on this? It's a marsh. I think it's just this guy. I can't see the circle. Okay. Yep. Let's try to take these out. Stay in there. I'm not. I'm trying to get rid of all the enemies, all right? Get out of there. What are you? I'm so confused. Oh, there's something else. Oh, yeah, okay, that one up there. I'm with you. All right, I can take that out in one shot. I just need to get to a safe space. Look out! Done. Oh, hey, there's another thing up there. Right, let's bring out what's her face. Oh, back. Okay. Trying to take out that spectre oh. looking for a body. Come at me, Spectre Bro. Hugging all the fun. You bet I am. I guess I could technically banish it. Let's go for it. I think that was one of the better combats. I actually remembered a few bits and pieces about what was effective against what there. Nice. Okay, we've definitely area transitioned because I'm picking up all the stuff we need for, um... Oh, bog iron. Nice. For some of the other upgrades. I guess bog iron is the thing for this no area. Way here. Well, if only you could punch it. Or rest at shelter. What shelter are we talking about? Up there. I'm down for that because I actually think I can upgrade a few things. Bug it off. 
course. I love how you love animals. Crows don't count. Yeah, crows. That's an interesting sign that. So I'm assuming we can come back this way. We can jump. Oh, unless maybe that's where the shelter is. All right, give me a sec. Okay, can't do anything this way. No worries. Oh, see, it's not even hoof, hoof fungus anymore. It's mossy polypore. This is everything that we need. There might be a way to open this door from the other side. Yeah, no surprises that it's locked. This game is very consistent. Um, okay, I can't see anything from there. Kind of makes you wonder why that was a thing. Okay, maybe we jump down there and I can do something in there. <laughs> Enemy scouts spotted south multiple assailants throughout the day. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Nothing? <laughs> Diane, I am in the doghouse. I inside caught me sleeping and although there was no danger, now I am punished. We cannot bury the dead for fear of new attack. I can see them as I write, lying where they fell, like sleeping wraiths drifting in the mist. All is quiet, and I am afeard. For a moment, laugh not, I swore I saw a corpse stand up and walk. I am so very weary. My nerves are gone, and coming here was the greatest mistake I ever made. I await relief from my watch, but no man comes to take my place. I dare not call down to the fort for fear of who might hear me, Arthur. All right, so zombies? This is like the most elaborate way to have to open a door ever. Do you need a moment to rest? Are you insinuating I am in some way a mere human? If you are, you'd be right. Martial disciplinary assignment. Soldier Arthur Ashtone, for neglecting his military duty and placing his brothers in arms in grave peril during their sleep. All his leave is suspended and his guard duty extended to three days by order of Colonel James Ironside. So I guess Ironside is going to be our new person. No? Maybe I can just jump over it. Okay.
in your thinking. So are you. Penny, for your thoughts? I was thinking of Kate. Of the pain in her eyes when she saw that ghost. As if her heart was breaking all over again. I can't shake the picture. According to her journal, Kate had had the courage to love a woman, but betrayed her. She must have meant this Deborah. Whoever this ghost is, her resentments extend beyond the new smiths. The sisters may heal if they can draw the family poison. Sisterhood can be complicated. You're not big on family, are you? A family weaves its bonds in trust. If the trust is broken, the bonds wither. Sounds like someone got hurt. When I was very young, I had a friend. She was my chosen sister and very dear to me. I opened my heart. It was a mistake. I played with fire and was burned. I'm sorry. It was a long time ago. I have a new family now. I have found the love of my life. Did you? Show me the bastard. <laughs> you idiot. <laughs> Rest now. I have the watch. I'll sit by your bedside until I must go. Must go where? Okay. Oh, hey, we've just got a new outburst, whatever this is. Okay. Maybe this is what we need to um, explode all the things. All right, but how does she do that? Okay, so we can't do any of those. Oh, okay, cool. So it just increases the amount of damage banishing does according to the enemy's health, I guess. Defeating an enemy with the rifle reduces the next... Uh, I mean, look, I am using the rifle like there's no tomorrow. Let's do it. Ooh, shooting with the rifle while the banished gauge is full increases rifle damage by 300, but consumes all banish points, right? Which, I'm not necessarily against that. While the spirit gauge is full, reds attacks decrease manifestations, cooldowns by... What's manifestation? I know it's, it's an attack that Antea can do, but I don't know what it is. Uh, defeating an enemy with red restores 10 health points. Defeating an enemy with Antea restores... I mean, that's not a bad one. Hitting an enemy with Antea reloads the rifle. Ooh. I could get on board with that. Maybe. Oh, what are you doing? I wanted to upgrade. Okay, we can do that after, I guess. Hopefully. Still learning what all like the buttons and stuff do. Okay, um yes, let's upgrade the weapons. I kind of wish I did that before. Sorry, I'm just looking at the damage and I'm like, 12 is not a lot of damage. Oh, whoops, wrong button. Ugh. Oh, hold on, what's this amulet? So increases r wisdom. I don't even know, like, these attributes. I'm assuming they must have been there all the time. I've only just noticed them and what the mess would any of them represent? It's 
So wrath would drop by two, but so many other things would increase. So increased manifestation damage. Okay, so I guess her damage is less. But there's a couple of things that would increase for whatever that's worth. Let's swap over. I mean, hold on. So let's just have a look at this actually because we can upgrade it. So I think the wisdom goes up by a little bit. Uh, the spectral resistance. So that's some of the stuff the other one did. So let's just stick with that maybe. Yeah, okay. So then we're just missing out on, I guess, extra wisdom. Yeah. I don't know. Maybe I should have gone with that one. Right, I think we're all good in the hood. What do I need for the rifle? Okay, I need more inky cap copper and... Oh, I can't fast travel either. Wait, so I can't fast travel between here and the other settlement? That's a bit Come tragic. Here. I want to try something. Hmm. Good morning to you too. Is she going to punch through the thing? Is that how we're going to access all these things that we couldn't access before? I think we can break this down together. Hold sure. on. Let me grab things have appeared. Let me... I'm Just collecting. Trust me. All right, cool. So she wants to do something. You. Oh yay, we've got a heavy attack now. So press and hold the mouse button to destroy physical objects and free passages. Did you feel the way I tore the veil? I I did. And we did it together. What did I do? You brought me focus. That's plenty. Can you do it again? Oh, I intend to. I just kind of wish that maybe they had connected that a bit more with, with what was going on in the story. Uh, it just feels like a huge convenience now that we can just bash through these walls. It's like, couldn't they have at least thrown in something about having faced that spectre and it giving her more powers or her embracing death a little bit more and it giving her more powers? You know what I mean? Oh, well, this is a nice big open clearing. Really can only mean one thing. Right, so I guess we're heading off that way. Just see what's up here. A chest, which I'm assuming is going to bring things to life. Or it's locked, one of those two.
Alright, the lack of combat there is a bit weird. Strange place for a stockade. Farm ground, marshy approaches. Might ban it, burn. 1314, and the Scots beat the English. You won the battle, but who won the war? Dunno. It's not over yet. I did just notice there's another chest up there. We get there. Good question. Unless we, like, can get down there and climb up or something. Oh, I hear more things. Oh, I can upgrade my rifle now as well. Huh. Press that button to do an outburst. Hold it to do, yep, more damage. So that's her heavy attack Shank, or charged do attack. Thing, no. Yeah! Keep doing this until he gets close. <laughs> Try this on for size. Now there's a talent I'd love to have. You'd have to die first. Oh, right, they're talking about her powers. I was just like, what talent? What? Yeah, I probably should have got her to explode or something, but, like, I couldn't be bothered. Oh, nice. Okay, so there's another spectral enemy sort of mass over there. I'll make a note of that, I guess. And never come back. I have to end this video, too. It's always a matter of like, where's a good time to end it? What's just around this corner? Get out of there! Do they like explode or something? Is that why she always tells me to get out of there? Sights red. I do appreciate that these guys kind of damp dance around a little bit. Dead are fitful and angry. Something hinders them, something bitter. Ooh, we just got some translucent fiber. I need that for um, an upgrade somewhere.
Do your thing. Blow it up. I love doing that. That's a witch's work. Can we seek her? We cannot be sure. Tread carefully. Okay, this looks like a big kind of spot. Maybe this is where I'll end the video. So many potentially shiny things. Yeah. <laughs> this might be a good place to leave it. We can see what awaits us. I can see those spirits hovering over there. Buildings. This reminds me a little bit of Bramble. Alright, cool. I'll catch you on the flip side.